So we have been teaching you guys all about prayer, and this week we actually have an amazing opportunity that we want you guys to know about and be a part of, so stay tuned. What's up everybody, this is Ronnie. And Mel. And on this channel we give you weekly tools and inspiration to help you find God and walk with Him in your daily life. So if that's something you need, consider subscribing and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an episode. Also, at the end of this video, we are going to be sharing with you guys an amazing story that will really touch your heart and will show you how God truly answers prayer. So make sure you don't miss it. So most of you probably already know this, but if in case you didn't, for the last 20 years of my life, I competed at X Games in a sport called freestyle motocross. If you don't know what freestyle motocross is, it's basically doing a bunch of tricks on dirt bikes. But now I'm retired, but I still get to be a part of X Games every year, but now I'm a judge. And so every single year we get a really unique opportunity to go to X Games and to just interact with all the athletes and to really just build a relationship with them, to love them, to listen to them. And sometimes we even get to pray for people and just to be a light in that industry. So last year there was something really cool that happened. So I remember I was just kind of standing out in front of the athlete lounge where all the athletes are. And I remember just praying and asking the Lord, we were about to leave, but I sort of felt like I was supposed to still be there for some reason. And I actually noticed that there was this kid who it was kind of clear that he had cancer and was sick. And so someone actually ended up coming up to me and they were saying how this kid wanted to get into the athlete's lounge, but he needed an athlete to escort him in there. And so I went and grabbed Ronnie and asked if he mm. could bring him in. So. In order to get into athlete lounge, you have to have a pass. And normally they don't even let you in, even with an athlete. Like the fact that it was at the end of the event, the X Games had just finished, basically everyone was leaving. The guy who was working the gate was basically cool enough to say, hey, I'm okay if you walk this kid in, but you have to bring him in. And the, and the young man just basically wanted to meet some of his favorite athletes, get some autographs and take some pictures. So check out this video and I can kind of see what happened. So the cool thing about this video that nobody would even know is, like I said, it was the end of the event. I walked into the athlete lounge expecting to see a bunch of athletes because it's packed all week long, all day long. I get in there, there's nobody in there. And I'm like, oh no, there's no one in here to give this kid an autograph or, or take a picture with him. So I just instantly prayed a 15 second short prayer. I said, Lord, bring some athletes. That's all I prayed. And while we were walking around, just kind of small talking, it was him and his sister, he was like, oh, I really wanted to meet Tyler Beerman. And he was my favorite during the best whip contest. And he's like, and I want to meet the Japanese guy. So sure enough, this is how cool the Lord is. Who do you think comes walking through the doors? Tyler Beerman comes in, both of the Japanese riders, Taka and Wanky. Cool story, how God can answer a simple, short prayer in a moment and touch this kid's life. He not only did he get to meet some of the BMX riders, he got to take a picture with his two favorite riders that he wanted to meet that night. And another thing, I just think it shows so much that the Lord really cares about every little desire of our heart. I mean, God didn't have to answer those prayers. God didn't have to just have those athletes walk in there, but he cared so much about this little boy and his desires because God loves to show he's real. He loves to show he's listening. He loves to show that he cares and he loves us. And what's so cool about it is the Lord actually cares so much that he didn't just bring athletes in the room, but he brought the exact athletes that the young man wanted to meet. 
I think that's so cool. And so I just think it's a great testimony of the power of prayer. Those 15 second, those little tiny prayers that you pray, it matters. And God loves to show that he really is the God that answers prayer. All right, guys, please be praying for us. We're headed back to X Games, Minneapolis this week. So keep us in prayer. We're believing for God to do great things. We want to come home and be able to share with you cool testimonies just like the one you just heard. So that's it for today, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make Make sure to give it a thumbs up and if you think it might impact someone you know make sure to share it because you never know the difference that you can make in someone else's life and we want to hear from you guys so be sure to comment below and let us know do you have any cool stories about answered prayer if so let us know down, down below <laughs> so we hope even this little testimony continues to help you find God and walk with him and we will see you next time